this is Kat here. I am the creator of the Roots and Wings Oracle deck and I'm really excited to show you what I have in stock right now. My update for um, the end of 2020 going into 2023. I have both of the mini and the standard size Roots and Wings Oracle deck in stock now and I'm so excited to share. I have simplified things in a way so I just have them in the little muslin bags and you can get the regular size or the mini size. The mini backs for this new edition are this beautiful kind of mauvey purple some amber tones. It's bright, it's lively and then for the standard size it is the same and what I had in mind when I designed the backs of these is for it to feel like it was bursting with life. And this design actually comes from, well, these have been shuffled, so I don't know if I'll be able to find it quickly, but it comes from my inspiration card. So I used that illustration to create the back of the deck and it's an illustration of roots that are going out in all directions and um, it's just about finding your inspiration, finding your direction, feeling connected in all of the different directions, north, south, east, west, heart, soul, body, mind, all of the different meanings and there she is. So this card inspired the back. And they still all have the rose petal finish now. Um, this deck has been used quite a lot and the more you use it the more um, it glides together easily but the first few times it might feel almost sticky. Like a dream. Let's see what card jump out for us. it's the inspiration card. Every deck comes with the full booklet and it's just a fold out. It's just a way to get started, to connect. Um, I did try to make this deck quite intuitive, um, but if you feel stumped and you just need a little bit of help at any point, this is here for that. And I'm always here. Feel free to reach out and ask me any questions. Um, I'd love to help. I'd love to help you connect more with your deck. The difference between the, the mini and the regular is the paper is just a little bit thinner on this one and it's just a little bit shorter, but it's the same width, just a little bit shorter and still pretty easy to read. I don't think I had to shrink the words down that much. And then the same rose petal finish on this one. And this one is a brand new, it's in order from abundance all the way to the world. And see when they're new, they just have a little bit more grip to them, which is personally part of the reason I chose this finish. It has been the finish of the deck ever since I started it. I did switch the mini back to the rose petal just because I feel like it makes you slow down with your cards. It makes you take pause and um, just kind of shuffle through them nice and easy and then I'm a very like sensing like feeling person and that I just I also love that they don't really fall all over the place too um, they're gonna kind of be a little more easy to manage but I also wanted to tell you about some of the other things that you can find directly in my shop catriles.com is I do, I love to sew. I've made some mini pouches. This one houses the mini deck and the guide. And I have quite a few different pouches left from when I released them just recently. This one is made out of cork, which is like a faux leather option. It has a great durable feeling. I also have some in the full size. This is the tulip. These are cotton pouches. Um, they are nice and, and soft and then I have a few more in cork for the standard size deck. Just 
nice and simple like that. And a couple other extra bonus things. The tokens are back in stock, and this can be something you can do with a reading. And you can kind of just get a little bit of guidance. One size says wings, and it kind of helps you sort of take that breath and step out of your comfort zone or out into something new. And the other side is roots, and it is that time when you kind of like settle in and really dive in and ground yourself. Um, another thing I did this season is I dyed some um, linen vintage napkins. I did some ice dyeing and made some reading cloths, and they each come with their own card that just um, is what I titled it by, and it's like its own little special card for the reading cloth. And I also have my original bandana that makes a beautiful reading cloth in the green and cream. And then I also have a limited edition of that same bandana. This one it's brand new in blues. So it's a nice blue background. These are 100% cotton. Um, they are organic cotton. They're printed with a low water process right here in North Carolina. So I'm very um, proud to have these in the shop and proud to just really try to be as thoughtful and um, yeah, just as, as special towards the things that I create um, as I possibly can. So I'm really excited to share these with you and I'm excited, I am, I am excited to share more about the cards and go into more depth with them for us um, in videos to come. So I hope you stick around. If you'd like to know more about the deck and some of the stories behind the cards, I'll be sharing more of that um, every couple weeks. And I'm also gonna start sharing about my new deck that I'm working on. So if you'd like to hear about what's coming up from the studio, Stay tuned, and I hope you have a lovely, warm, and um, love-filled day.